Did you know that there's a way to delete the anonymized Siri recordings that Apple may have on file for you? In this video, we'll show you how, but there are some consequences for doing so. Thanks for watching Apple Insider. Don't forget to hit that like button and be sure to hit subscribe and turn on that notification bell so you know when we upload new videos. A little bit of context why you may want to turn off Siri for Mac and iOS is because a report came out recently that a small number of recordings are passed on to contractors working for Apple, tasked with determining if the Siri activation was accidental or on purpose. Now, These select recordings were manually reviewed and according to the report, some of these recordings contain some extremely sensitive personal information. Now we've spoken with Apple last week and confirmed that you can delete what Apple may have on file for you in regards to Siri recordings. However, we were also told that since the numbers of retained recordings for quality assurance purposes are so low, the odds are that you don't have any retained data, but here's how to do it anyways. On the Mac, if you go to the Apple menu, select System Preferences, go ahead and click Siri and disable enable Ask Siri. Now back in System Preferences, you can click Dictation and you can turn Dictation off. And that's it. Moving on to iOS, if you go into settings, tap Siri and search, turn off listen for Hey Siri, then go ahead and turn off press side button for Siri. Now after Apple's warning that you just turned off Siri, go back to settings, go to general, tap keyboard and turn enable dictation off. If you have an Apple Watch or a HomePod, you don't need to do anything. Now that you've turned off Siri for both your Mac or iOS device, there are two catches. The first is you're going to have to do this on every Mac or iOS device you own as the recordings are not tied to an iCloud account. The second is that once you turn Dictation or Siri on again, the potential retention starts again on that device, albeit with a new anonymized identifier. But for now, Apple has turned off manual grading collection. There are changes coming though, so if you toggle Siri and Dictation on and off for now, it may be the only time you have to do it. Now, if you are setting up a new device, you can opt out of data collection. Sources inside Apple not authorized to speak on behalf of the company say that doing so will prevent the data from being collected and has always done so. Additionally, there are reports of a custom device that users can install to prevent these recordings. For now, we really can't recommend taking that step until safety of the profile is guaranteed. And Apple says you shouldn't really install untrusted profiles anyways. Anyways, what are your thoughts on Siri? Let us know in a comment section down below and we'll see you in the next one. Hey everyone, did you guys like that video? Be sure to click on that like button so we can create content that we know that you guys want to see. And follow Apple Insider on all social media channels. If you want the best prices on any Apple gear, check out the Apple Insider price guide that is updated daily. And until next time, we'll see you later.